Welcome to our lives. I'm Gwen Edwards. People of color from across America and the Caribbean are losing their sight, going blind due to glaucoma. But I'm telling you, it does not have to be this way because glaucoma is preventable. Dr. Daniel Roach joins me now with more information. Thank you so much, Dr. LaRoche. Thank you for having me. All right, let's talk about glaucoma. I personally know a lot about it because it runs in my family as well. Uh, why does it affect people of color more than the majority population? It's one of the most common, uh, most identifiable causes of glaucoma is the lens inside the eye. The lens, as you get older, becomes larger by about 30% over time. And in some people, that contributes to elevated eye pressure by closing off the drainage angle and by rubbing up against the iris, releasing pigment that blocks off the drain. So it's very important everyone gets their eye pressure checked as part of an eye exam, particularly if you're over the age of 40. Now, the normal eye pressure is 15. If you're 15 or less, that's usually the normal range for most people. But then if the, with age and as the lens increases, and some people, the pressure can go up to 18, 21, 22, and you don't feel it. Mm. That could damage the eye and the optic nerve. It damages the optic nerve in the back of the eye. This is the part of the nerve that connects to the brain. And when this gets damaged from high pressure, that's how you lose the vision. If your doctor can pick up all your eye pressure that's high, they can treat it with eye drops, okay? That's the standard of care now. But in my practice, what I've evolved is doing earlier surgery to take the cataract out with a small device, a small device that's like this. It's like a hair, hair sign device where we can open up the drain at the time of cataract surgery to lower the pressure. And oftentimes people don't need eye drops. And if you catch it early enough, you can prevent glaucoma. February is Glaucoma Awareness Month. Yeah. What should we be looking for? I know you say you don't feel it. Well, a crude test you can do is Take a look at your credit card and then cover each eye. Can you see the credit card and the small numbers with one eye and then cover the other eye? If one eye is very dark, like one, you know, if it's very dark compared to the other eye, you want to get your eyes checked. Thank you very much, Dr. LaRoche. Very helpful information. Thank you. Alrighty. And we want to thank you for watching our lives and we hope to see you the next time.